Hi everyone and welcome to Oscar Outdoors. In this one I want to go over the contents of my new cook set. Right, welcome back everyone. So as in a little intro, today we're going to talk to you about the contents of my cook set. So if you are a regular to the channel, you'll know that recently I've been the victim of a crime where I had my backpack lifted from the car and literally an entire setup taken from me. So the backpack, the cook sets, the pouches on the side, everything all just lifted in once at once and uh, thankfully you guys have helped me uh, replace a lot of that gear so thank you very much so today i'm going to show you what we've got in the cook set the pouch and all the features of it stick with me okay so first look at the pouch uh, as you can see it's quite a large pouch going by the size of my hand uh, you've got a molly line on the front there and three vol velcro lines on there so you can put your own patch on there so this is just a, a cook set label that i've had made up uh, two zips or bi bi-directional zips going all the way around a couple of d-rings on the corners there and then lines of molly and pals on the back with four um, molly tabs on there uh, so that's it let's open up the pouch as we said it's sort of bi-directional clips so i'm just going to remove this sort of velcro tab on this side and i'm going to go all the way up and around so it should open up like a bit of a clamshell now, so I'll just pull that down a bit. So here we have my cook set, so as you can see here I've got some replacement jars for all the little herbs and spices that I'll have in my cook set. They're all ready to be filled in. So in the back of this side we have a chopping board, as you can just see there, just a white one. And then this is a grill. So if I'm going to do, like I don't know, uh, a little open fire and I just need to have a little base to raise something up and give it a flat surface. So that's on that side. Uh, on this side, uh, uh, we have the cooking oil, uh, sorry, the vinegar in the middle. And then we've got a bottle ready for some cooking oil and also some bioethanol. Uh, they will be clearly labelled so I can't mix them up. Uh, you can see here we've got a 6, 7 and an 8 opinel and um, we've got some little bellows there there's space there for a lighter maybe a knife sharpener something like that as well that we can put in there and then on the back side here we've got my tongs and then a trimmed down spatula the little Descati's stove little alcohol burner um, a Luxada sort of windshield and then my, a knife, fork and spoon set all in this sort of neoprene case so that's the uh, contents of that so what we're going to put in the spice jars I'll go over in a second okay, so what we're going to put in the spice jars eventually will be your standard salt and pepper uh, a bit of steak seasoning and some chilli flakes that'll be the first four they'll be my first sort of four uh, go-to spices then I'm going to create what I call Scott Spice so it's just salt, pepper and chilli flakes all mixed together in one little pot and just sort of grind it down that little bit more just to make it a little finer dusting um, and then in the rest what we could do is we could add in just some obscure ones maybe so I don't know maybe a little bit of Cajun spices a little bit of ginger uh you know a little bit of garlic powder any of them things that you could take while you're out and about and just to make your life a little bit easier and your camping meals a little bit more flavorful that's what we're going to add into there uh, the lighter that i've got coming uh, is a turbo flame um sort of rip off that i've picked up from aliexpress because although i like to have uh, some good gear i am a bit frugal as well and i do spend uh, quite wisely so yeah that's everything that's in the cook set 
stick with me. Okay, so that's everything that's in the cook set. Uh, so if you'd like this video, I'll give it a thumbs up. If you're not a regular subscriber, please consider subscribing to the channel and find out some more future videos where I show you what's in my fire kit and what's in my possibles pouch and also some of the pouch kits that I've uh, going to be making up. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.